In this video we'll be talking about fair use. So this is something that's very confusing to a lot of photographers and people wanting to use photography. It's basically the question of can I use this photo for the purpose that I want to? So fair use is the exception to intellectual property rights. So a couple of videos ago we talked about the different types of licenses, commercial, editorial, and retail. Fair use is that exception that's saying that you are allowed to use this photo and you don't need to have a license. You don't have to have a contract or pay to use this photo. And there are two ways that you can use a photo for any purpose. One is for educational purposes. So when you are teaching your class, you can use photos in your teaching or if you're doing student research. So if you are doing a research project, you don't technically have to pay for a photo that you're putting into your project. And then the second way is if you're making commentary and or criticism as a news report. So Jon Stewart of The Daily Show is famous for all of his rants and his social commentary and he often includes photos of the people he's making fun of and he's allowed to do this because he's critiquing them he's making a commentary about them as a news report and so this is why people like Jon Stewart or lots of blogs and websites and magazines make fun of other people and they don't get in trouble for using photos of them fair use is different than public domain public domain means that there is no copyright owner and that that photo because there's no copyright owner is free to use for anyone for any purpose so fair use is different than public domain and then creative commons is different as well because creative commons is saying that this photo is available to be copied modified and redistributed and it can even be redistributed for money but it's just a different thing it's it's the photographer saying that you have the right to use my photo by giving you putting it in Creative Commons and you can find a lot of Creative Commons photos on Wikimedia Commons it's like a Wikipedia site for media for photos and other things those are the three things in fair use that I wanted to cover so remember fair use is allowed for educational purposes and if you're making a commentary or criticism as a news report this isn't the same as public domain which means that there is no copyright owner and therefore you are free to use the photo and this is different than Creative Commons which is when the photographer says I'm putting my photo out there for free use. I hope you really enjoyed this lesson. If you have any questions, please let us know because I know licensing and fair use is a tricky subject. So please let us know if you're still confused. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in another video.